what happens, especially this time of year on, on Saturdays, coming home after a West Point football game, it backs up. You wouldn't believe how bad it backs up coming home. You go to that game? Uh, they canceled that game, you know. Oh, I thought the warning said we are going to pay. That is the KQ2H repeater on the Catskill Mountains near New York. Today is uh, Wednesday the 12th of October 2022, local time 12.58 GMT 1.58 British Summer Time. The scanner here is connected to a 70 centimeter vertically polarized yagi up in the attic pointing eastwards towards europe so this is coming in off the back of the beam and it's on the totally wrong frequency it's faded out a bit now um a few a few minutes before i started the video it was even stronger than it is now but interestingly it barely breaks the squelch at all on my vertically polarised collinear for 2 metres and 70 sems. So the moral of the story is, even if your antenna is totally unadapted to the frequency you're listening to, it's always worth tuning in because you may still be able to hear something regardless. Good afternoon. The time is 2 p.m. Okay. That may have been a different repeater on the same frequency, actually, thinking about it. Uh, Golf Bravo 3 Charlie Quebec, which is very local to me, is actually on this same frequency. Um, if you fancy accessing uh, Kilo uh, Quebec 2 Hotel, the input is 100 kilohertz lower. I don't know if you need a tone to access it these days. There was a time you could get in just using a carrier. But I just wanted to show you this as a way of encouraging people to, if you're just listening and not transmitting, even if the antenna that you've got is totally wrong for the band you're transmitting on, it may be worth having a listen regardless. And in case anybody was wondering, um, yes, some signals on 27 megahertz were equally as strong. Um, on channel 6, 27 decimal 025 from memory the Super Bowl channel in AM that's the American frequencies not the UK frequencies there was a very strong station I heard on here earlier uh, specifically calling two or four stations in England don't know if you got a reply propagation has possibly changed and the whole thing's faded out altogether now maybe but uh, I thought you'd like to see this as especially as the repeater seems to have changed its K tone for what sounds like a gunshot. <laughs> right, I'll stop talking now, but I'll keep the video going for another minute or two, just in case it fades back in. So, 7-3, and uh, keep listening. You never know what you'll hear out there. Have we lost it altogether, maybe? Incidentally, I did hear a different repeater on 29640 quite strongly earlier as well, but I don't know which one that was. Okay, well, either propagation has dropped out or simply nobody's using the repeater. Either is possible. So, 7-3, uh, thanks for watching, and hopefully this will be an encouragement to you to... Uh, Listen on amateur bands, even ones that are miles away from uh, where your antenna is resonant. <laughs>